Hello, I'm Jacob Lundhoff. Um, this is a response to um, one of the videos of someone uh, posting on um, YouTube about what they think were the worst best picture winners were, the worst Academy Award winning pictures for, uh, were, like the ones that you watch and say, I can't believe that one best picture. I'm going to list my, my personal picks and I'll get to the number one in a second. One of my most overrated films I think in history has got to be Forrest Gump. The 1994 fable that starred Tom Hanks and won his, his second Best Actor Oscar and was directed by Robert Zemeckis who also directed Who Framed Roger Rabbit, Polar Express, and Back to the Future. Who Framed Roger Rabbit and Back to the Future was actually good films. But Forrest Gump, not so much. Forrest Gump, Count 94, of course it starred Tom Hanks, uh, cast includes Seinfeld as his mother, Mama Gump, Robin Wright from The Princess Bride as Jenny, and um, McKelty Williamson as Bubba, um, who uh, is obsessed with shrimp who Forrest meets in the military when they're getting ready to serve over Vietnam during the Vietnam War. Forrest Gump was so slow moving and so boring and so slow. It was well acted, I will give it that. And Tom Hanks gave a great performance of someone who was mentally retarded, but the problem was the film itself was just boring. You just didn't care when you watched it. You didn't care about Forrest's journey. I didn't accept it at all. It had a few um, mild moments. Um, Forrest running down the football field through the band. Um, Forrest finding out he has a son and a few other ones. But, but overall, it was definitely a waste of time. Another one that was least deserving of best picture, but another contender was Dances with Wolves. Kevin Costner and a bunch of Indians or whatever, if I remember correctly. It's been a while since I've seen the film, but it was just terrible. Kevin Costner's film career doesn't do much for me. The only thing I ever liked of his was Field of Dreams. And this is another film where it was kind of like, it was just like Waterworld. I'm like, why did I watch this piece of crap? Oh, and uh, there was a few other ones that uh, I think we would never, I would try to name. Let me think here. Well, I was never a big Lord of the Rings fan, but if I had to say the number one choice for the worst picture, uh, you win best picture, the worst movie to win best picture, I would say it was Crash. Um, the, the Crash starred Sandra Bullock, Don Cheadle, and a bunch of actors, Brennan Fraser, um, Jennifer Esposito, who was really hot, or used to be. Um, but the film was just so horrible. There was too many storylines. It was kind of like that movie Love Actually with Hugh Grant. Um, there were so many storylines in the movie that you couldn't really think of, um, um, didn't really care to follow them. And uh, the characters were so um, slow and boring. The characters were boring. The storyline was boring. I mean, and it was just too long. And uh, there's only like one or two moments where I actually kind of, you know, got interested in two scenes, but I think the worst Best Picture winner of all time, honestly, well, actually within the last, I guess, within the last recent years, I think um, Crash beats all of them. Forrest Gump, Dance with Wolves beats all three of those films as the worst movie to win Best Picture. Picture. But Forrest Gump and Dance with Wolves are probably runners-up, to my opinion. I'm Jacob Lenhoff, and that's my opinion, and thank you for watching this response.